the Ancho students was really cool because it was a new experience and we got to learn a lot. Adding on to that, it was really cool to um, uh, interact with them because it was uh, a different experience as we interact with different people every day and it was really nice to see how, how their school is different from ours but also the same. worked with or I hadn't really hung out with people with special needs before and I think we were all kind of worried that it would be awkward and that they would stay in their groups and we would stay in our groups um, and we just really didn't know what to expect. Actually for me it wasn't I wasn't very nervous actually I have quite a bit of experience with people with special needs so I knew what to say to them I knew what to do so I was excited actually. was when they first came because as Anya said I didn't have much experience with people with special needs and it was like as a Hindi speaker it was really interesting to know more about them before anyone else in my advisory so that was my favorite memory. My favorite memory was when the kid I was, uh, I was assigned to um, he didn't he didn't stick to the designated ac activities he went to the lawnmower that plowed the the mowed the grass on the field and started climbing over it. It was really funny and I learned to follow the follow their lead. We eventually I had to take him off and uh, <laughs> learn from that experience. So what works well is that you have to let them try to do things. You can't just be doing everything for them. If you're doing everything for them, they're not gonna enjoy really. You have to let them, give them opportunities, but don't also, don't force them to do everything. Like if they need help, help them, yeah. So for me, the best thing that worked, like the thing that worked the best was not staying with your friends and then letting them stay with their friends, kind of like interacting. Cause then I feel like it wasn't just an hour of you standing there while that just go, still, student kids are standing at the other side of the field. So try to interact with them because that was really fun and it was really helpful. Um, I think some tips are like to use body language because and like smile a lot. It, it, it helps the kids like enjoy more. Yeah, be positive all the time. They can tell if you're negative, so being positive really helps the experience. Don't just talk to your friends, because you can always talk to them, but with you only have a certain amount of time with the Ancho school kids, so just like try and make the most of it, and just go